I am having so much fun with this big toy. Oh my goodness, this excavator is amazing. We've already smashed like four truckloads of wood chips. Uh, we moved a ton of logs that were strewn about the place into a really cool like climbing gym for kids, both humans and potentially goats one day. And uh, now we are putting her to the ultimate test and, uh, and digging this pond, which is actually really quick business with something like this. So um, it's like a three foot scoop right there with the uh, hydraulic thumb, which made it possible to move logs around, which is amazing. And um, it just chews right through this like clay and silt here. It's really unbelievable. So I'm stoked. This is gonna be the, uh, the fish pond, which is just like a beautiful view from the dome back there and uh, appropriately put out in zone four if you follow permaculture design. And um, I'm just so stoked. This is just the beginning. Um, eventually, it'll be much longer and deeper. But uh, this is this is like a serious dream come true. And I'm so grateful to the guys over at James River for demoing this Hitachi 85. Um, and uh, I don't really know anything more <laughs> than uh, kind of how to use it at this point. But um, I'm getting good at it. I see the appeal. You know, I think the tractor is sexy too. And, um, you know, although ideally this would be running off of biodiesel, if I had all the money in the world, I would buy one in a heartbeat and buy a biodiesel kit for it. Um, because these are so fun to have on a homestead. This is like an unbelievable expense that um, we are lucky enough to, uh, to just like know good guys. So um, thanks guys for letting us do this. And uh, I'm really, really excited about the natural fish pond and aquaponic setup that we're gonna have out here because they made this possible. So thanks.